everyone. Thank you for watching our Stories of Hope. Uh, it took me a while because I couldn't figure out the technicalities of it. Um, but I do want to share my story of hope, and I hope that it will encourage you as well. Mine has to go back to a year ago when I spent so many weeks in hospital uh, with pancreatitis. There were so many different side effects of it uh, that really debilitated me physically um, and uh, emotionally and psychologically. After two or three different uh, recurring bouts, um, I started to really lose my, my sense of hope. I started to lose my hope. I, I started to think, am I going to be able to endure if more and more things keep happening to me? And the big source uh, that kept me uh, going was my sister. Uh, she visited me many times a week. We'd talk about silly things. We'd talk about serious things. After many weeks, I was so I was so physically weak, more than I knew. I was emotionally weak, more than I knew. And I started to I shared with her, what if I just don't have the endurance? How do I keep putting up with just one new thing coming after another? And uh, she took me seriously, and she didn't answer with some overly optimistic, some some uh, saccharine, uh, da, da 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 you know. She just said, and you'll endure those. Now, that would not have had a lot of meaning to me if I didn't know that she was going to be there, no matter what, what happened. I knew she was committed to me, and she's the one that helped me get back uh, my sense of hope, get back uh, my sense of hope that I could physically be better and uh, emotionally uh, restore my hope. Um, I've told people uh, proudly that uh, she was a, a huge part of my recovery. Uh, we were close, and I feel now that we're closer than ever. Uh, so hope for me came through my sister, and through my faith. It's a serious story. I don't want uh, the seriousness of my sickness and the seriousness of my story to discourage you from sharing a story. Yours can be much simpler. Yours can be happier. But I know you've got a story to tell, a story of hope that you uh, were able to receive from others or hope that you were able to give to someone else. And we need each other's stories. We need each other's encouragement. We need to be open to each other so that this can be an advent of blessing, of true blessing, of assuring each other that God's promises can be fulfilled. And that will lead us to a happy and holy Christmas. So please share your story and God bless us all.